Um, we've particularly recently got interested in snoring um, and looking at the vibrations related to snoring that occur around the throat and the neck where the vibrations are generated and whether those vibrations had energy that was damaging the carotid artery in the neck and which is the, the source of where you may develop a stroke. As it turned out, um, sleep apnea is sort of one of the unrecognised giants of diseases. Um, it has a really high prevalence in the community, um, but has been unrecognised for many years because it occurs while you're asleep. What we're researching that's different from the past is to focus on the role of vibrations related to snoring in the neck and the fact that they may directly damage some of the structures in the neck, including very delicate structures such as the arteries, carotid arteries that supply the blood to the brain and uh, it, it appears that these vibrations can damage the lining of the arteries which leads to atherosclerosis. At the moment snoring would be regarded as a, as a, a noise pollution and an irritation to many people um, who would complain about it um, but it may well be that snoring on its own has quite significant medical consequences. Um, and it may indeed turn out to be one of the significant causes of stroke, which is obviously a cause of major uh, morbidity and mortality in the community. So understanding that as a mechanism will be you know, really important in terms of looking at preventions and treatment for stroke.